Hey guys, Minecraft Turtle here. Today I'm posting a video on how to install HD texture packs on Minecraft. I'm gonna show it on the example of LB Photorealism Pack. It's a 256 by 256 texture pack. Yeah. First you go on this page and download it here. So after you downloaded it, you click on your start button of Windows or yeah, and t type in percent app data percent just like I did here. Then it's gonna show up a folder called roaming. You're gonna click on that, and probably the first thing you see is dot Minecraft. You click on this folder go into texture packs and just copy the file you just downloaded into there, into this folder. It, you leave it as a zip archiv. You need win or no, you don't need WinRAR for this because you don't have to un unpack it or anything. You just copy it in here. Then you gonna go on this side I'm gonna put the link in the description too and download the latest version of this. Yeah. After you've done that, you just copy the ex executable file onto your desktop or anywhere else and start it. So, usually this window should open. Now, you just look where's texture pack. Then you go on Browse, go search for your texture packs folder. It should be open already if everything's okay, and just choose the right one. After it's done loading, just gonna take a second because it's pretty big. There should be a cross, and it should say the right size. If it's not, you can change it here. After that, you just check if the Redmi says anything, if you have to unclick one of these, but if not, you just click on Patch. I'm not gonna do this because I already did before. Then you just can click on Test Minecraft or Open your Minecraft. I'm gonna do it in a second, but change my video recording software right now. See you in a second. So guys, if you installed everything right, Minecraft should open without any problems. And if you got a black screen, you just gotta delete your bin folder in the .minecraft folder and then restart Minecraft so it can re-download it and then do the Mac patcher thing. Then it should probably work. So this looks like... Yeah, my Minecraft has installed the texture pack. So now I'm just loading it for a second. Yeah, gonna take a second. But yeah. Now I'm just gonna show off the texture pack, and yeah, that's it for this episode. So, as you can see, all the blocks are really detailed. They look really good. This is ice, for example. It's really nice. Water is okay. Yeah, just everything really shiny, but yeah, I think it's cool. So, dispenser, furnace, yeah, everything pretty basic. So, dirt, and now to yeah, wool has some decent texture also. Just wanted to show you how it looks when you break a block. Also really nice made. And yeah, this is normal smooth stone. So now let's go down here. Letters, letters also look pretty nice. So, my cards also look really cool, I'd say. A bit darker, but yeah, I'd say it fits to Minecraft skin. 
so. That's an iron door. Looks a bit like a wood door. Yeah. It's okay. Spawn isn't too nice, mate. I don't think it fits too good to the other things. But yeah, the cobblestone looks really nice. Also, mossy cobble is made pretty well. The chests are looking good. Sorry for the frame rate issues here. My dear, my sling. Okay, I just got a black screen, I'm gonna go back to commentary in a second. So guys, I'm back. I just had some issues opening Minecraft again and had to reinstall some things, but yeah. So, these are mushrooms. They have pretty nice textures, also the gravel looks good. So let's go on. By the way, torches look like this. The flame animation isn't too good, I'd say, but yeah, it's okay. So this is coal, looks good. This is iron, also okay texture. Redstone looks pretty nice. Gold also looks nice. The lava has some brown things in it, but I'd say it's cool. So, diamond and yeah, Abyss Lazuli also look decent. The obsidian looks cool, I'd say. Now, let's go to the nether. Pretty nice texture pack. Bye bye.